What's up, everybody? Welcome back. We are going to watch an Uncle Roger video. If y'all don't know who Uncle Roger is, it's a character made by, I, I think his name is Nigel. I think his name is Nigel. But he's a funny, cool guy, and he re does food reaction videos. My girlfriend introduced me to him. I don't know much about him, but I enjoy his content. So I'm going to bring it to you guys in case you haven't been exposed to this content yet. Thank me later. Uh, I'm going to need y'all to drop a like, comment, subscribe, share, hit the bell notification so I know when I drop some more heat for y'all. And let's get into it. Uncle Roger thought induction stove is the worst thing you can cook on. But some people out there are animal, and they cook food in coffee maker. I made a boiled egg in How? a coffee maker in a hotel room. If you're traveling and Why? you can't afford food, maybe the solution is not coffee maker. Maybe the solution <laughs> is don't travel. <laughs> Hello, niece and nephew. It's Uncle Roger. Hotel is terrible place. If you've been to hotel, Uncle Roger guarantee they don't wash the coffee maker at all. And now in this video, this niece here, she making a whole meal in coffee maker. Hi. Oh, meal. It like she want to get diarrhea on purpose. Everybody <laughs> is disgusting in hotel room because not our house. We don't give shit. We treat hotel room like how how to basic treat his house. Remember, <laughs> oh, you know it's how just to basic. comedy we joke. Uncle Roger just joking around. Don't go attack anyone after this. Just laugh. I made a boiled egg in a gotcha. coffee maker in a hotel room. Ordering room service at hotels can get pretty expensive, and when you travel often, sometimes you just crave home cooked food. So what? This is your home cooked food? Hi, uh, <laughs> what kind of broken family you come from? Your mother making food in coffee maker. You need to get new mother. I think this girl <laughs> mom is psycho. First, here are some items that are easy to carry in your luggage. Instant oatmeal packets, instant ramen. You know what uh. easier to carry than all those things? Cash. You can use this <laughs> to buy food instead of making it in coffee maker. <laughs> Flour tortillas, small paper plates, Flour tortillas. sheets, and plastic cutlery. All of these items fit perfectly into one food storage bag and nicely that look like most depressing holiday ever. Also, imagine if you get stopped at custom carrying that pack of shit. <sighs> <laughs> Uncle Roger rather get stopped for carrying white powder. And by white powder, I mean MSG. Uh -huh. Once you arrive at your destination, you can hit up a local convenience store or grocery and pick up small items like half dozen eggs, maybe some bacon, and then Wait. What? Once you arrive at your destination, you can hit up a local convenience store or grocery. So you're gonna go to store anyway? So yeah, what why do you pack just those get things. food from store? Why bother packing that sad food in bag? What her logic? Yeah. Hi, yeah. Oatmeal. <laughs> Place instant oatmeal in a coffee maker <clears throat> carafe. <clears throat> fill the reservoir with filtered water and turn it on. Looks so sad. To sit for a bit. Pro tip, if your room offers complimentary tea bags, just add it to your oatmeal for some extra flavor. Ew, no. who add tea bag to oatmeal? Why you exactly. want your oat to taste like a grey tea? Oatmeal is the saddest food ever. It's so sad, even MSG cannot save it. It like white people <laughs> congee. Congee <laughs> is one of Uncle Roger's favourite dish ever. <laughs> it's a classic Chinese breakfast dish or something you eat when you sick. That right, in Asia, when you sick, you just eat congee. Nobody need doctor. Mom, I have COVID. Just eat congee. <laughs> <laughs> offers complimentary tea bags. Just add it to your oatmeal for some extra flavor. Yes, for tea bagging. <laughs> for tea bagging. See so what you get into. This niece, but being tea bagged by someone still more hygienic than using hotel coffee maker. Sorry, children. <laughs> Ew, look at that. I also love a little so bit of fresh fruit on top. Gently place eggs in the carafe. Add filter wow. water. I guess Turn on the boiling machine. egg okay. Allow the eggs to sit for about seven to ten minutes. Peel and enjoy. For some ramen, place the packet contents into the carafe. Add, you guessed it, filtered water. 
Turn it on. So she making instant noodle now. Cooper oatmeal with instant noodle. What is? <laughs> and enjoy straight These out are of the, the questions, bro. Make sure you clean the craft <clears throat> ribbon belt with some soap and water afterwards. Here's what you can make you with an iron. <clears throat> so she gonna destroy the coffee maker. Now she gonna destroy the iron. Hi. Almost died. Form just an now, iron yo. sheet pan by folding. Who travel with foil aluminum foil? Un Who packing for trip? Going okay. I pack shoe. I pack jean. I pack my underwear. Feel like I'm missing something. Hmm. I know. <laughs> Travel essential. Allow the iron to heat up, and you can cook items like bacon. Use some of that bacon fat to fry an egg. You just need a little bit of patience. Wait. So you have to hold in the iron this whole time. How much free exactly. time this woman have? Are you unemployed or something? Ain't the iron gonna spill? Or make a quickie quesadilla on an ironing board. No, no, no. Then tortilla, spread on the cheese, and iron it out. They're trying to make a whole case of mm. that first tortilla all, is so pale, bro. Replacement for real fire. You want to cook? My use God. the real fire. You want to walk hay? No such thing as iron hay. Also, <laughs> when business people they actually want to use iron to iron their shirt, and now they smell like bacon and tortilla. This woman gonna get them fired. Feeling fancy? Use the coffee maker to make actual coffee this time. I get a small oh container of ice cream and make yourself an avocado dessert. I may not be in a sweet, but I'm sure living the sweet life. <laughs> you can tell the exact moment she regret her decision. She trying hard to pretend that it tastes good, but Uncle Roger bet after camera stop rolling. She just go pleh, pleh, pleh. Secretly, she just dying inside. But it not <laughs> only her. See, this another video. Can this chef make three course meal in coffee maker? Another Hi one. Yeah. Why are you all torturing Uncle Roger like that? Why? Why? I'm Alexis, and I'm the senior food specialist here at Taste Date. Oh no! Please don't. You can leave it. No, don't take her rice cooker. <laughs> I don't drink coffee, and I think I've. You don't drink coffee, so how you wake up? Is it just the voices in your head? It feels hot, <laughs> so I think I can actually go ahead and add the shrimp. So we just want to make sure that the shrimp is cooked through and pink. You, it's actually turning pink. You can see it turning pink. It turning pink because it embarrassed to be seen with you. <laughs> if Uncle Roger hang out with woman who put seafood in coffee maker, I turn pink also. Auntie Helen have new boyfriend now, and I hope her new boyfriend only make food for her in coffee maker because that all she deserve. <laughs> I'm allowed to say like give myself a pat on the back, but this is really good. She gonna make Oops, salmon, salmon in coffee maker and asparagus. Next, I'm going to poach Ow. the salmon. It needs to be enough oil to submerge the salmon. Ah, she making salmon oh. confit. The salmon down so that it'll actually fit in the coffee pot. I'm gonna infuse okay. the oil with some peppercorns, lemon rinds. Okay, dill. decent right. ingredient. I'm getting the oil to about 180. I'm gonna yeah. add the salmon in. So. Uh. Oh, <laughs> this looks really gross. The fat is clearly leaving the salmon. Ew! Yeah! Mm. Made him put you the knee down. Right. It grows the fat leaving salmon, and you should leave kitchen. Hi, uh, <laughs> salmon is beautiful fish, and you treat it like this. It looks like you the salmon it. mutating. It trying to grow legs so it can escape from there. <laughs> the fat is clearly leaving the salmon. Also, niece and nephew, this not fat. This a protein in salmon called albumin. And when you cook salmon albumin. too hot, it all come out like this. It make Uncle Roger put my leg down from chair. I think because in this coffee maker, you can't control temperature. The heating yeah. at bottom. So bottom part hotter than top part. Uncle Roger don't know why she use thermometer to measure temperature. You can't even control that shit. But it looks like, it, oh my god, it looks like it's covered in warts. There's like Get little life together. balls of fat. Ooh, <laughs> there's like... That her little <laughs> dance <laughs> is a gross thing. Oh. 
Okay. Ugh. The salmon. I don't know. Look just like Auntie Helen before makeup. This uh, needs a yeah. thorough wash after what just happened. Yeah, no shit. On to part two. So for this, I'm gonna yeah. like simmer some beans. I just putting beans in a coffee pot feels wrong. Bro. What? What's she or saying? Stock. What What's she, she saying? Say? I just putting beans in a coffee pot feels wrong. Putting bean in coffee pot feel wrong, but putting but the corn same in and salmon in there feel right. What? What this woman thinking? Uncle Roger would hate to be her roommate. Good morning. Time for my coffee. <laughs> Why coffee tastes like fish? Did you make salmon again? Hi. <laughs> so hopefully <laughs> no. tomatoes can blacken and kind of... Run for your life, tomato. They gonna torture you. Uh, hopefully they can get some char. Ooh. Okay, there's some sound. Just like Jamie Oliver Weijo, you hear sizzling, I hear your ancestor crying. <laughs> oh, there's a little bit of, a little bit Just of Just, that not enough color. Oh, you might as well eat it raw if it look like this. I'm yeah. almost done, so I'm gonna text some friends, see if they wanna come up and try it, and... You're gonna text your friend, don't invite You're gonna kill these people. people to eat this bullshit. <laughs> if your friend invite you to their place to eat coffee maker food, they not friend. I feel like they're gonna have <laughs> some inclination to something's up, but I don't think they would guess a coffee maker. I get courses here? Okay, her I voice is the most here. annoying voice Uncle Roger ever here. I changed my mind. She deserved to eat coffee maker food. <laughs> One and done. One and done, me honey. You One and done, me honey. I did. It was. One and done, me honey. That all Uncle Roger here. <laughs> One and done. <laughs> We've got some white beans with olive oil poached salmon, steamed asparagus ribbons, and blistered tomatoes. It's good. Okay. You like you like it? Hi, uh, wear your taste bud. Wear your taste bud. Exactly. A challenge today to make all these three courses with a twist. What was the twist? Oh god. I made all three courses using only a coffee maker. Stop. Agree. Stop making food in coffee maker. Hi. <laughs> her new boyfriend always cook for her. I hope Auntie Helen, new boyfriend, always cook food for her in coffee maker. That all she deserves. <laughs> all right, let's try coffee spitting scene. Let's try to not ruin any of my <laughs> furniture or laptop. <laughs> Let's hope I got it. <laughs> <laughs> if they invite you over for coffee maker food, they not friend. Friend, don't try to give friend diarrhea. Uh, nieces and nephews, feel free to Photoshop this still. Um, it can be an Uncle Roger meme, you know, right? Just put text on it. <laughs> and by white powder, I mean MSG. <laughs> <laughs> you can clearly tell I've never done coke before. <laughs> Hey, you. This is how people do coke. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all for joining me once again. I hope y'all enjoyed that. I definitely had a great time. It... Don't do anything. If Uncle Roger is reviewing it, don't do anything <laughs> that they're doing in the videos he's watching. The, the culinary gods will smite you where you stand. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna start doing more food reactions because I enjoy it, man. There's something new for the channel, because why not? Um, thank you all for tuning in. I'll catch you on my next video, and peace out.